Good morning and welcome to my channel. My name is Teresa and I go by the name of Blue Live and Beauty. And today I am getting ready for work, but I am so excited that I am going to share my five top refer brushes with you. I am doing a collab with several other ladies that will be listed down below. Um, it's Lori's Life. She um, started this collab. So go on over and watch her video and check out the other ladies down below. I am going to warn you, I have eight brushes in front of me, but I am going to point out five as I do my makeup for this morning. And if I didn't say, and if you're new here, welcome. My name is Teresa and I go by the name of Blue Living Beauty. And we talk about all things beauty, life, makeup skincare complexion is my my love and fashion all right so i'm going to be featuring some products that i haven't reviewed yet but i have been using nothing is new i'm going to be um, doing the makeup by mario um, foundation and this is 18w i had to Return this foundation three times before I got my right shade. So my first brush that I am going to use of refer is this number 32. And I am going to use it to do a bit of concealing. Now refer is a natural hair made of two different types of goat hair, undyed goat hair. And go hair is said to apply your makeup. Well, natural hair brushes are said to apply your makeup a lot smoother. The bristles are a lot softer. All the brushes are handmade. And Refer is an affordable brand if you want to get into using natural hair brushes. I first learned about Ruffer, I think in 2021, doing a Behind the Beauty with um, Kelsey Brianna J, um, Glam Girl Chelsea, and Kinky Sweat, Alicia. They had the, <clears throat> the CEO on their program. And so that's when I got into the Refer brushes. Now the Refer um, company has a program called the Concept Store. And if you go to the Concept Store and try out any of the brushes that are featured at that time, they give you a certain amount of time to go back on and do a review and tell them what you think about the brush. And then they will offer you a discount on other brushes. So that's a good way to start your collection. Now, like I said, I use this number 32 for my concealer. I am going to go into this number 31, which is a soft, dense foundation brush. Now these brushes clean up well. I know in the beginning I was a little hesitant. I was like, oh, I don't want it, my brushes to be ruined. I don't want them to be stained, but they clean up so well. Refer does have a um, brush cleaning solution. I haven't tried it. But I know people that have and love it. Refer also have other products. Um, they're slowly adding to their um, company. They have different containers that you can order to organize your makeup. See how smooth and pretty that does. It makes a difference in what type of um, 
fibers are in your brushes. And I didn't learn that until later in life. Synthetic brushes are okay, but you need to look at the quality of the brand and the brushes that you are using. So buying an expensive brush isn't the, the goal. This is um, an example of a synthetic brush that's similar to this. And this is uh, Shantakai. This is synthetic. My next brush I'm going to share are my eye brushes that I use all the time and I love so much this number one. I love it so much that I have three of them. And I'm sure because when I first got started, I ordered an eye set and then I went through the concept store and ordered a different set or individuals that I was able to get discounted. But this is a nice, um, it's a little dense, but I like it to um, place my eyeshadow where I need it. And I'm gonna use it in a second. This number two is also an uh, eyeshadow brush and it's a short haired brush. And it does the same thing. So if you wanted to do a uh, certain, um, just put makeup in a certain area, it's good to target those areas. And I also have two of those. Yes, I have two of those. Um, what is this? Okay, so this is another example of the number one, but this is a Shantikai brush. It's synthetic. You can see how much easier the natural hair brush moves but I'm sure this one costs more. Both of them, good quality, love both of them. Okay, so what are we doing next? Next, we're gonna go in with some bronzer. So we've used three brushes, we've used four brushes, and that was quick. We used the foundation brush, the number 31. We used the concealer brush, number 32. We, um, I showed you one and two, which I am going to use. But first, I am going to do my bronzer. I can get it open. So I'm going to use this number four. It didn't seem like it picked up a lot. But you see that impact once you put it on your face? And this is Charlotte Tilbury and the uh, number three. Yeah, I had to make sure. I mean, you don't even have to dip your brush back in the um, product, you can just use it, use what you have on your brush. And for me, I like a light application from day to day. I like a light application and this is what these brushes provide for me. I'm gonna do my concealer. I'm gonna conceal on top. This is the Tom Ford, this is the new, um, found um, concealer in 5C0 Carmel, the Traceless Soft Matte. I have been playing around with this. So I'm just going to do this with my finger and put this on with my finger. I used it with the Tom Ford Soft Matte. I don't know if I need to replace that foundation, but it didn't wear so well during the day. So I've been playing around 
with different products with this um, concealer. Okay. I didn't use a brush, but I needed to put that concealer on. Okay, so we're going to go in with our Donessa Myricks Color Fix. And this is Cappuccino. And I'm going to, I'm going to put it on my hand. Because <laughs> you know, all you need is that much. Can you even see it? But, um... Don't be fooled. Now I have hooded eyes, so this has been great for me to go above the crease and keep it controlled. See that nice smooth application? That little dot of makeup will go a long way. Okay. I have this little swirl because I don't have my um, cloth over here. Just wiping my brushes off. And now I'm going to use my number one. And I'm going to go into just the Huda Beauty. What is this? The Mercury Retrograde Palette. That's how that looks. And I'm just going <clears> to <throat> take one of the neutral colors and go over top of it. Even though I've had my brushes for a while, one thing I do notice, some of the brushes still do shed a bit, just a bit. Not anything crazy that you can't live with. Okay, so we did one and two, we did four, 32, and 31. But I need to put on some blush, so I am going to use my number four again, and I'm going into my Danessa Myricks Bellini Yummy Skin Cream. And you only need a dot. That's it. Okay, and the last thing that I am going to do is do my finishing powder. And this is uh, Charlotte Tilbury number two. And I am going to go in with my number 30 and just go all over my face. going to spray what my Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Airbrush Finish Spray. Let that sit. The lip gloss I have on today is my Pat McGrath lip gloss. Can't tell you the name of it because can't see it. 
And the last thing that I do is just take a clean sponge and just mainly go over my eyes and under my eyes, I'm sorry. Just make sure everything is melted in. Put on some mascara. Charlotte Tilbury. So if you are ready to dive into the natural hair brushes, go over to Refer and um, check it out. I do believe I'm going to check with Lori before I post my video to see if she has a discount code. If she does, it will be down below. If she does not, one of the other ladies may, um, Enamor Beauty, is a part of this collaboration. And she may have a, a, a discount code as well. So once you check out those ladies' videos, they'll also inform you if they have a discount code. always have to go over the eyebrows because I have to do my eyebrows first to get this makeup going but with all the application sometimes you mess it up and you just have to go over it and it's okay all right you guys have a blessed day and don't forget to check out all of the videos about refer brushes, we might be all talking about different brushes and how we use them. Thank you for watching.